And getting chips in your windshield from rocks on the road is a norm here in the valley. But drivers alongside Highway 48 towards South Padre Island say the new paving job there has made these issues even worse. Local 23's Iris Karami spoke with TextDot and brings us more on the plans engineers have to resolve this issue. On Facebook, many residents have taken note of the loose gravel on Highway 48. Some saying their windshields have broken. And this is my wife's car. Texas says they are working with a contractor to repave from FM 2480 to FM 500. But the pavement did not adhere correctly. The seal code on this road was done late last week. And over the weekend, a combination of factors, including the weather and the traffic, prevented the oil from adhering to the rock or the aggregate, as we call it. Currently, there are street sweepers out cleaning up the highway while they work to repave the road. Now, engineers have reviewed the components of the mix and have adjusted it to fit environmental conditions. Uh, we began to sweep two days ago all the excess rock. TxDOT says what they are doing is applying a seal coat, one part of their maintenance program. TxDOT spends close to $180 million maintaining 186,600 link miles of roadways, and seal coats are a very important part of TxDOT's preventive maintenance program. But some people want whoever is responsible to pay to fix the damage on their windshields. TxDOT says residents can file a claim on their website under claim resolution. We like to remind everyone that whether or not road hazards are present, the driving public should always maintain safe driving distances between vehicles at all times. Putting local first in South Padre Island, I'm Iris Karemi.